Hi everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be talking about the Cassie 19 crossbody in chalk and signature canvas. So I was able to carry her around and I'll be showing you what fits inside, show you some mod shots and then talk about some pros and cons. So stay tuned. So again, this is the Coach Cassie 19. It's with the, it's in chalk and brass with the signature coated canvas and refined calf leather. The lining is fabric and it's this maroon color. It's not quite ox blood, maybe it is. The camera's picking it up much brighter than it actually is. It's definitely fabric, it's not microfiber. It doesn't feel like suede or anything like that. So it comes with three straps. It comes with this detachable chain strap that has a nine inch drop. And it comes with a detachable long strap that's 21 and a quarter inches drop for the shoulder or as a crossbody. I have this adjusted already, so that's why it's got a little kink on it. And then lastly, there is the detachable short strap with a four inch drop. So let's put all these straps together. There's the long strap, the short strap, and the chain strap. So I was obsessed with this bag forever. I usually would get this in black, but I wanted to try like a lighter color, a lighter summer color. I loved Coach. I was obsessed with Coach back around like 2010, but over time I got kind of turned off by the styles and the signature canvas that I was just seeing everywhere. Um, I'm finally loving Coach again, and so I'm loving the Coach signature canvas once again and I think it looks I, I know this is white but it does look a little bit different it's a little more subtle with the C's so some of my favorite things about this bag is I love the multiple looks you can use with it so I mean this chain strap makes it look so so classy it really elevates this bag so you have this it could be i've used this as a shoulder strap as one shoulder strap top handle and crossbody and this also fit way more than i thought and i will show you in a little bit um some of the cons about this bag was when i was first taking this out and about i noticed that the strap I think it was a long strap to this crossbody, but it probably could be any of them. It kept snapping off, like coming off. I did have all three of them on there like this. So that might have something to do with it. Maybe you're not supposed to have all three on there. But I mean, why not? And, you know, it became a little bit humorous because it kept coming off, like popping off over and over again. And of course, I probably can't recreate it right now because I'm filming, of course, but it was actually kind of funny. But it's, you know, just something to keep in mind. I haven't heard this being a problem really for anybody else, so it probably is just me. But let's move on to what fits inside. So in here, we have one compartment here, one larger compartment here, 
a, a smaller one here and also a back slip pocket here. So a lot of compartments, a lot of space to put stuff. And there's also a little zipper compartment back here too. So let's see first if a full size wallet will fit. So let's try putting in my Sippy wallet. It's just a touch too big. So if you have it of a smaller full size wallet, it would probably fit, but I think this is just really bulky. So um, it does not fit a Zippy, this Zippy wallet. But it does fit a mini pochette. Yay. It's a great catch all, of course. Key pouch here. And since we can't fit our zippy wallet, we can try fitting in a card holder like so. We can go up front here. So far, so good. And it fits. So I've been putting my phone back here actually. So again, I'm filming with this phone. So this is the case for my iPhone XS. So it fits an iPhone XS fine. But let's see if you have a bigger phone, if it fits. This is my other phone. It's my um, iPhone 7 Plus. And she fits great in there. And let's see if a sunglass case will fit. I don't think so, because my sunglasses case is very bulky. That's gonna be a no. So with this bag, depending on what, I mean, if maybe if you didn't have the mini pochette in here, but a pouch for your sunglasses would work great. This is definitely heavy. I think it's from all the hardware, all the straps and the leather. So this got pretty heavy pretty fast, but for such a small bag, it fits a lot. So let's see if we took out the mini pochette, if we could fit some more in here. Let's see if it fits a full size. You can, and then you can put back your key pouch. You could even put your key pouch up front here with the card holder, maybe. Yes. And you could take some stuff out from the mini pochette so my contact lens solution and because it closes completely like this I'm not worried about things falling out so my Burt's Bees tinted lip balm I don't really wear lipstick um, and then maybe this Winky Lux here So if you wanted to bring your full size sunglasses case, it definitely would fit in her, but you wouldn't be able to fit like a mini pochette type thing in here. So anyway, that's what fits. The stitching is fantastic. So other than that one strap that kept coming off of the ring, 
It is a great multi-use bag. You definitely get the bang for your buck with this handbag because you can wear it so many different ways. You can even, you know, when I first showed it in the beginning, you could use it as a clutch, um, a crossbody, a shoulder bag with this chain strap, a top handle. This top handle is nice because when I'm going in and out of the car, I can just grab it by the top handles like this. It's just really convenient. And also you can even get more bang for your buck if you watch sites like Macy's because I saw a black one that was on sale for $197, which is great. And this one was $297. Anyway, thank you for watching and stay tuned for some mod shots and I will catch you guys later. Goodbye.